Hi, good morning, everybody. Aloha. Um, so the, the message we put out yesterday in the media advisory remains the same. Most of Hawaii Volcanoes National Park will be closed Friday, tomorrow, and that is in anticipation of the possibility of an explosive steam event here at the summit of Kilauea. Um, the part of the park that will remain open will be the Kahuku unit, and that is in the uh, southwestern part of the island. This is a 116,000-acre part of the park that is in Kau, uh, near the 70-mile marker, for those of you who know. But so not all of the park is closed, but the main part of the park near Kilauea, all of that will be closed, including Volcano House and Kilauea Military Camp, the post office, etc. It is complete closure up here in the summit area of Kilauea. Um, what else? Uh, so the, the park, it closes uh, tonight at 10 o'clock. That's its, um, our, our recent hour structure, and we will be closing at 10 o'clock tonight. So after that, nobody will be let in. The other things, uh, we do not know when we'll reopen. It uh, really depends on, on, on what is going on at Kilauea. And uh, the park is, is uh, you know, the, based on the, the information that the scientists have been providing, you know, our, our key message out there that is we are not expecting this to be a life-threatening event unless you're in a closed area, so stay out of the park. Um, we are expecting it to be more of, I believe, Don Juan called it a nuisance event. So um, we will provide more information as it becomes available. Go ahead. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. One more thing for our local media here on Hawaii Island. There's been numerous calls about what will uh, volcano residents do who have a P.O. box here in the National Park. Uh, the post office will deliver that mail to the Volcano Village post office, so you can get your mail in Volcano Village. Employees and also campers who and backpackers who might be in the area, um, I'm just wondering what is the mechanism for getting people out of the park who might be in the back. Uh, you know, regions up on Mauna Loa, and also how um, how are the park employees um, going to be taken care of during this period of extended unemployment? Sorry. Hi, Jeannie. Good morning. Um, <clears throat> that country is not open. It has been closed since the 6.9 earthquake. So we've been in a partial opening. There's nobody in the backcountry right now. We have a very limited opening since um, Sunday when we when we reopened. As far as employees go, so, uh, we had a meeting yesterday at 4 o'clock and informed everybody that uh, they come into work today as normal. And for those of us who can telework, uh, pack up, you know, get ready to go at their normal ending time today. But we are, you know, getting ready to get people out. This, again, um, you know, most of, many of our employees right here in the Volcano Village and in the Puna and the Ka'u districts, again, this is not being considered a life-threatening event as long as nobody's in a closed area. This is more of a nuisance event. And so um, that's the impact we're looking at now. Um, we do have employees, however, that are under considerable stress, and we have um, the Employee Assistance Program. That's a federal program for uh, DOI employees to assist them with any kind of counseling that they might need. Um, so we have those mechanisms in place. 